Welcome uh, to another episode of a Saint Vincent Untold Stories. On uh, this episode, we feature uh, Roland Gums, uh, the man uh, charged with uh, sending Atiba Waldron uh, to Dovecat. Uh, Gums uh, claimed that he was uh, set up. Uh, that uh, some bad man ran in and uh, took his uh, poodle from him. And if he doesn't uh, do what uh, they say, they would keep uh, the poodle forever. Uh, big ups uh, to all of my subscribers. And if you are new to the channel, hit uh, the like button, uh, the subscribe button, and hit uh, the bell icon if you wish uh, to see more videos like uh, this one. Uh, yesterday, we did an episode with Atiba Waldron, and we told you uh, that he was a uh, Sylvester Allen's uh, right-hand man, a.k.a. Rambo. I remember I told you uh, that it was because of a difference uh, between our uh, two childhood friends, uh, Rambo and Afri, and that is how most of the beef uh, started in Paul's Avenue. Uh, so, I explained how the men were buying a puff, a puff, and Afri was not uh, playing a fair. Uh, so, he got Rambo uh, mixed up in a sticky situation, and uh, then uh, the beef has started. Attack! Uh, some bad man ran in and took uh, the lives of uh, Fry and a youth called Nikki. Uh, some of the prosecution witnesses uh, gave some statements and uh, said uh, that it was unknown assailant. Uh, then uh, the main prosecution witness uh, came back and changed his statement and uh, said that he saw Rambo and Atiba Waldron. Uh, but you see, uh, there were too many inconsistencies in the case. Uh, so after doing uh, some time on remand, uh, the men were set uh, free. Uh, but you see, uh, shortly after that, uh, there was another knock-ins. Attack, uh, tack, tack. Uh, this time it was a Tiba Waldron, a.k.a. Krimo. Uh, you see, when those uh, two things happened, it was hide it time. Uh, the man them go for the man them brawling. A dog heart man carry. Hide it time. And them can't identify nobody. Uh, but you see, the police conducted uh, their investigations. And they couldn't understand and hide it time. A uh, driver escaped and hurt, and uh, then another passenger escaped and hurt. Uh, no, that is not right. Let us take the driver into custody. Uh, do you remember that yesterday we mentioned the name and told you that he disappeared in thin air? Yes, man. Uh, the other occupant of the vehicle was none other than Jamal Finch, a.k.a. Cribbit. Uh, them soldiers are the dark. Uh, the allegations are that when Gums and Cribbit uh, saw the car approaching, uh, they decided uh, to jump out and run because they had already seen the car following them. Uh, you see, everybody was wondering how come a car is following you and you still pulled up at a gas station. Uh, so everybody waited until the smoke had cleared uh, to conduct their own investigation and they said, no sir, this is a setup. Uh, several men were picked up, arrested and placed on remand. Uh, some of uh, those men uh, stuck to their statements and said uh, that they knew nothing about her uh, that. And uh, they were freed. Uh, you see, remember, gas artists and have a camera. Uh, so the investigators uh, said, no, sir, something not look right. As soon as the man said the car, pull up the man, jump out. Uh, now we got to hold him. Uh, do, do, do. Uh, tell us who did it, uh, boy. Do, do, do. I am not talking, officer. I am not talking. Real bad man, I sell out. Do, do, do. I said, tell us who did it. Uh, so, officer, if I talk, uh, can I get a plea deal? Like, unless at time. Uh, yes, sir, boy, you can. Once you tell us uh, the truth, who did it? Officer, officer. Uh, some bad man uh, took my poodle. And they told me uh, that if I don't uh, do the job, uh, that I didn't know where I live. And they would come for my family. Officer, officer, I miss the poodle. The poodle is my favorite dog. Uh, so the man them uh, tell me, see, uh, me and the boy are my friend, and tell them we can conduct a business down at Shatterbele. And while on the way, we'll uh, pull in uh, somewhere. Hey, bad man, you free poodle yet? <laughs> poodle, boy, pull in a gas artisan. It is alleged uh, that the men started to get impatient, and uh, they told Roland to pull in by the gas artisan. I remember a cribbit a real bad man and cribbit eyes are always on the road watching his ass around him. So cribbit had already seen the car and got nervous. As soon as uh, the jeep uh, they were traveling in came to us, uh, tap and car, they run up and do so. Ah! Tack, 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 tack. 
I roll and jump out, crib it, jump out and run. Uh, the way the man I talk, the thing about her, the pool. Uh, some of the men were freed. And only him and another man uh, was uh, scheduled for sentencing. Uh, but it so happened uh, that uh, the other man uh, passed away while in prison. Uh, yes, his other co-accused was none other than Marlon Stokes. A uh, boy, they have some individuals right here in St. Vincent that really love uh, their dogs. Uh, some of them would go to the supermarket and buy cases of chicken uh, for their dogs instead of their own children. Uh, some are wondering if uh, Roland was uh, so much of a dog lover. Uh, some are saying that Roland should have just called the man and said, Yo, Atiba, you need to leave the place and now the man them dear to you. Uh, so it was either one of her two things. Either the dog was really a pencil or Roland uh, loved the other dog a lot. If uh, this was an excuse uh, to get off, watch an excuse. Uh, so what Roland did, he did not want to face uh, the full penalty of sending a man to Dovecat. Uh, so he pled uh, guilty uh, to a lesser charge and he was given a five-year sentence. Uh, just imagine a simple incident like that uh, took uh, the life of Atiba Waldron, a.k.a. Krimu, one of uh, the bravest men uh, to ever step foot on Vincent Jana's Isle. Uh, could it uh, be the same uh, situation? Uh, why uh, Sylvester Allen, a.k.a. Rambo, and uh, Carla Ballantyne is still missing up uh, to this uh, day? Uh, when we look at uh, some things uh, that some brave men got uh, sent uh, to Dovecat uh, for, we have to say, look, uh, boy, something is really wrong. Uh, you see, when uh, Stokes was uh, sent to Dovecat, uh, some persons made uh, some allegations and said that uh, the reason for the heart attack is because one of the bad men inside uh, put something in his food. As a general, as a bad man, you have to watch your surroundings. Watch who you eat from and who you take uh, things from as well. Uh, you see the master of Kata ascending that I just occurred up tongue a while ago. Uh, the men have to watch uh, themselves whose name are calling in those dove cutter sendings. Uh, because anytime you slip, uh, the man them are going to catch your easy. A cat and mouse, the man them are playing. Around. You think uh, so, the man a while up themselves? Uh, look at how easy uh, the men are sent a Tiba wild run, aka a criminal, uh, to dove cut. Uh, when uh, they did uh, the social inquiry, it was said uh, that uh, Roland was a good candidate uh, for rehabilitation. Uh, so, all that uh, played a factor uh, why uh, Roland was given less uh, time. Uh, but you see, uh, Roland had already did uh, some time on remand. And uh, when he was given uh, the sentence, the man them said, look, yeah, you don't spend enough uh, time already. Uh, time for what? Uh, so the question right uh, now is, uh, did Roland get uh, back as uh, a poodle? Did uh, the men free up uh, the dog? If it was a mongrel, would it uh, be the same uh, situation? Uh, boy, that man got her uh, to love uh, that uh, poodle. Some bad man is running at uh, your place. Grab up your poodle. And tell you what, yeah, if you not drive a man to a certain location, we send them on a dove cut. We'll keep uh, the poodle forever. And uh, not only that, we'll be coming back for you. Anyhow, you don't uh, do it. Uh, so another question is, what if Atiba Waldron did SRK? He might have come back uh, for gums and the other occupants who conducted uh, the mission. Uh, you see, now all this uh, thing, it seems like a cribbit was the innocent one. Uh, because you notice Gums did not call Cribbit a name at all uh, to say uh, that he was involved in the setup. Uh, 4504, uh, 3536. Uh, we need uh, to get in contact with uh, Jamal Finch, aka Cribbit. Uh, WhatsApp has the number. As I uh, said uh, before, uh, St. Vincent is a safe uh, place. But it so happens that uh, there is an internal beef uh, between uh, some men uh, going on. And uh, you see, uh, this has been going on uh, since uh, the times of uh, Friar and Rambo. And look how long Friar passed away. And uh, some man still are doing knockings over that. And uh, we have to ask uh, the question again. Uh, what if uh, when the men were conducting uh, the business deals all year round with uh, Fry and the boys, if uh, Fry had uh, dealt with uh, the Bobo Jed and them shit, Tandola stories who want to say condolences to all who lost their lives in the cross of fire.